Hello. Uh, this is the tutorial how I paint my Sons of Medusa Space Marines. I'm gonna go through what different stages and what colors I'm using. Uh, I'm gonna paint up this uh, Hell Blaster from the Dark Imperium box set. It's prime black, nothing special about that. I uh, always leave guns that are covering the chest uh, on a uh, separate. So it's easier, easier to paint. Uh, the colors I'll be using for the armor with the airbrush uh, are Caliban Green, Smooth Green, uh, this light lively green from Gelevalejo uh, Game Air, and I use some flow improver uh, when I in the colors. So let's go. I'm gonna start off by painting this guy Caliban Green. So, I'm not using a special airbrush, I got my Sparmax 3, it's a 3.5 needle I think on it. And I think I have it at PSI 2.5, the compressor. So, let's go. With the Calvin Green, I cover e everywhere the model because this is going to be also kind of a shade. So, here you have the Space Brain all painted in Calvin Green. Uh, when I paint, I try to paint from underneath because uh, this is going to be kind of a shadow. Uh, next up, we're going to paint some moot green on it and we're gonna spray it from above doing a 45 angle kind of like a cenethal uh, highlight so let's do it I tried to concentrate the colors on the parts they're gonna sh show, uh, like uh, the shoulder pads and the knee pads and the uh, feet. So uh, don't be afraid, afraid uh, to put extra paint there, because uh, you see, then the Calvin Green will show underneath. So we got, almost got a shade already, but I do a couple of layers with Mood Green. This is how it looks. So, on to the next stage. Okay, now we got uh, bright green Space Marine here. Uh, we could end the airbrushing session right here. It's okay. Uh, I like, though, I like to put uh, a bit of a yellowish highlight. And I like this uh, light, lively green from the uh, Lego Game Air. Uh, so, yeah, like before, from uh, well, from above. Uh, just to get the really on the top of the armor. So let's go. As you see, uh, you can't really see the difference in the color. Uh, but uh, it gives it small yellow tones. Uh, it's gonna help when we highlight it later, or if you want to highlight it later. Yeah, like this. So, uh, that now we're done with the airbrushing, and we're going on to painting. 
So, uh, on to the next step, we're gonna paint some black. Gonna paint uh, all the cracks in the armor that shows the under armor. I'm gonna paint all the pouches black. I'm um, even gonna paint these. I don't know, the, some thingies on the back. I'm gonna paint metal. Uh, on the backpack, power plank. Uh, yeah. And uh, the gun. I'm gonna paint the gun all black. All the parts are gonna be metal. Gonna be painted black, not except uh, here on the helmet and the circle on the backpack. So, uh, for that, I'm using uh, Barejo model color uh, black. That's the number. It's really flat black. I like to use it as uh, base and also for fabric. Uh, for the rims of the armor, I'm gonna use um, uh, later on, I'm gonna put on a second layer but then I'm gonna use Abaddon Black because it's more shiny so yeah just to be really neat because we don't wanna damage the green not that big of a problem if you get a bit sloppy and paint on the greens because we're gonna highlight with mood green anyway so so yeah like that I'll be back when that's done so uh, next step is to paint the head and uh, ego on the chest with the celestial gray as a base for the white we're gonna put there so uh, yes uh, yeah really need to with the eagle so. so I'll be back when it's done uh, next step is to paint all the metallic parts I'm gonna paint the tubes on the helmet on the backpack the gun these uh, thingies and also the plasma rifle so and for that I'm using lead belcher uh, the best metallic base color there is at the moment so so this is what the model looks like at the moment. Uh, all the base colors are applied. Uh, next step is putting on the shades. I'm gonna use uh, Biltan green in all the cracks in the armor. I'm not gonna dip the, the model in green. I'm just gonna put apply in the cracks and the shadowy areas. Uh, null null for the metals and Draken of Nightshade for all the white areas. So. Like this. I think it's called pin wash. Just to get all the details out. that the shades are dried you got this nice blue on the white um, you can see all the shade in the recesses I use a really small brush when putting on the, these shades so I don't have to fix it up okay there's some parts you can't uh, <laughs> you can you gotta get sloppy on them but that's not a uh, big trouble problem so, uh, next step is to start highlighting the green. Uh, you can all... What I do is I use Mood Green. I use Flash Kits Yellow. I use it in my um, wet palette. And I mix them up together uh, to, to get different shades of green. So there's a smooth transition. I can show you on one of these models I done. 
to see in the camera but uh, this is how it would look when it's done I do some kind of a wet blend yeah well let's get on it so I do it on the feet here the camera yes so remember just keep in the really wet color the paint so let's get nice like transitions so yeah highlighting I'll be back when it's done so all the green parts are highlighted gonna look like this so yeah uh, next step is painting all the white area and the trick in painting white is not painting white it's uh, painting light gray uh, as I said I based with celestial gray put on uh, dragon of uh, nightshade and now I'm gonna paint Althan gray and gonna highlight with uh, white scar just a little bit white scar not much uh, so the trick is painting and with Alton Gray and leave uh, some of the blue grayish areas for depth. So yeah, that's it. Gonna go back, come back. So um, okay, all the special thingies are done. Uh, the whites are done. The greens are done. The only left is uh, doing the gray highlights and I'm using Mechanical Standard Grey uh, mixed with a bit of a white to do edges blue lenses and then the gun but uh, this is the end result so the OSL is just uh, different blues mixed with whites and uh, doing it brighter the the cows are from the Space Marine transverse and these are from Chapter Customized. Really nice store doing different uh, transfers and stuff for custom chapters. It's not norm for GW. So yeah, this is how you paint them. Sansa Medusa. Thanks for watching. Bye.